Yo, what is up, Bucketeers? We are back with episode three of Life is Strange and Shit is Certainly Strange. And shit is definitely getting crazy, bruh. We fucking save Kate's life. And I'm gonna make sure it stays that way. Downloadable content is not installed. Please install the episode you wish to play. Uh, what? It says it's already purchased. You gotta be kidding me. Hold on, let me close this application and reopen it. Cause I'm about to, I'm about to go, I'm about to trip. Yo, I was doing some stupid stuff on Instagram, like doing instrumentals with my mouth, like doing it shitty, beatboxing basically. And I was surprised at how many people didn't know of Rubber Band Man by T.I. That song was the shit. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, okay. So, see, they had to read. It had to read the content. There we go. I was about to say because what do you mean? Did the game just delete my shit? Because I'm about to get I'm about to get hella pissed if I gotta re fucking play all that shit. In the previous episodes of Life is Strange. Tell me, tell me what happened, girl. Little pieces of time. Because Max wants everybody to see I'm how so sick is. of people trying to control me! Don't ever touch me again, freak! It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. You know. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> You're going to be sorry someday. Bro, leave her alone, bro. Y'all are assholes. And there she is. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Let's talk about your superpower. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. You're my business now. That's and Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? You want me to cut you, bitch? Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Please, get me out of here! Max! Nobody cares about me. Nobody. I do. What are you doing here, Max? Now, I know today was difficult for everybody. Miss Coffee, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Please, tell us everything. What the hell is this? Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I believe you, Warren. I'll believe anything this week. Yo, that train shit, that train shit, I don't know what happened, but I think it's kind of bad that it got derailed or shit. Or not even derailed, but not going to where it's supposed to be. And that could potentially be very, very bad. Hold on, let me move this. Oh shit, I should probably just keep it where it is. That could be very, very bad. Um, I don't know what, I don't know. I don't know what the consequences of that's gonna be. We can only just find out, so. I seen someone in the uh, the comments, they was like, have you been getting hit with like copyright for the songs? I was like, hell yes, bruh. These are some nice songs, but them shits is definitely copyrighted songs. But it's all good, y'all. I just recently started, uh, like started monetizing this channel. So like all the other videos you've seen, I've just been doing it for free, just because I want to. But yeah, I just recently monetized it, so. Gotta water that plant. Life is Strange, episode three, Chaos Theory. Danielle recently got a camera that prints out pictures. It's so dope. Hold up, let me show y'all. One of me, my hat is off, so this is just for y'all. This is just for y'all. Well, look at this one. Hold up. I have something to show. Meet me in front of the campus. Get that ass in gear now. I Wait, knew Chloe would be all over this, so I better get moving. Why is she? Did she scream Kate's name, or is she just having a bad dream? Sorry, I was. No, 
pay attention. Maybe she was just... Hold up. There's been so much going on, I almost forgot about the eclipse. Okay. Oh, it's... All this atmospheric action can't be a coincidence. It's an eclipse. All roads are leading to my tornado vision. Oh, I'm sorry, Lisa. I saved Kate, but I drowned my own plant. What? You mean I was... I was giving it too much? Come on. Are you a hungry bunny? Here, nosh on this. So you mean to tell me I wasn't supposed to water it each time? Get the fuck out of here, bruh. Plants are supposed to be watered every day. I would know. Uh. It's amazing how happy Kate looks here compared to today. She didn't she even She was basically pushed up to that roof. And I will use my power to find out why. You damn Lisa right. Ew. <laughs> Thanks for the image, Nathan. And everybody here thinks Samuel is a creeper? Uh, to be honest, she doesn't. She didn't even look that happy. In the uh, in the shit. What's this say? Pretty hard to focus on my class schedule this week. She I got wonder them, why. She got them AP classes. What a brainiac. Okay, we fed the rabbit. We looked at the rabbit. All right, y'all. I got it. Like I said. Oh, pictures. We almost forgot. We almost forgot. All right, so we got a trophy, it looks like, of something singing, someone singing. Uh, we got a little ro uh, rodent. No, it's a squirrel. Most likely a squirrel. Uh, we got some fishes, so probably some aquarium action going on. Uh, smoking kills. That's probably like a poster or something. We got a little bird trophy thing. Um, something there. I don't know what that is with the arm. Another bird, an actual live bird. Uh... I don't know what the two people standing somewhere. An ant and that last thing. I have no idea. I have no idea what that's supposed to be. I like how they made that look as horrible as possible for me. I appreciate that. Can we play the guitar? Get a little tune going. I appreciate the love. I appreciate the love y'all showed on my last little tune. Alright, hold up. Okay, it's okay, Max. Take a breath. Get your shit together. You have time. She, she need to make a connection of, with that shirt. Creepy as fuck. So is it in okay, the middle? This is scary dark. Let there be light. This ain't about to turn into a scary game, is it, bruh? Because we'll wait for Kate. Y'all know I hate scary games, bruh. Y'all know I hate scary games. Let's not do this. That's our room. That's a depressing thought. And it's always about Victoria. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. What? Do they really need that crap on the door? Kate's still alive. So much hypocrite. Exactly, bro. Fuck, yo. Oh my gosh. I hate that when that people don't care about people until something bad happens, yo. The only time they want to show compassion is when like niggas are on the brink of death or on the brink of killing themselves. There's this dude. I, hold on. The fuck is this? I hope Victoria feels particularly shitty about posting that link. Exactly. Hi, Taylor. You fucking basic bitch. Hey, Max. I saw you go up on the roof and save Kate. I can't believe she tried to jump. You can't believe it. You can't believe it. Taylor, you know that y'all are the reason, right? You know that you're the reason, right? I, I should not have any fucking comfort to you. You fucking talked shit about Kate. I'm not comforting her. For her. Fuck you her. You should believe it. She almost jumped because you and everybody here bullied her. What? You're, like, blaming me? As a matter of fact, yes. Then just get out of here. Like, stop fucking with me. I already told you that my mom is in the hospital. I'm done for the day. So that makes it that makes it okay for you to bully people? Fucking bitch. 
I said I'm like done, Max. Please leave me alone. Be mad, ho. I don't care. It is your fault. Think about what you've done and bask in that guilt. I don't give a fuck. No regrets, bitch. Ma ma uh, she is my friend. Oh, look who. Wait, hold on. Do I need to be mean to her? Hey, Max. Who the fuck is. Come here. Oh, shit. You already see. Dana's me. really hurting over this. What do you want? What do you want? Let me stop. She's the she's the cool one, right? Hey, Dana. How are you doing? Better than Kate. I just can't believe she would even attempt suicide. We're all responsible. I ain't responsible. She was depressed. I knew she was depressed, but I had no idea how bad. Must be serious to throw yourself off the roof. Why was she on the roof? Kate was serious. That's all you know? Why was she on the roof? So why do you think she was on the roof in the first place? Maybe Kate was so ashamed she got wasted on that video. I don't blame her, but it was pretty gross. Come on. You really believe that Kate Marsh wanted to get drunk at a Vortex Club party? So what exactly are you saying, Max? You think this has something to do with Nathan being expelled? Oh, it has a lot to do with Nathan being expelled. But it's complicated. It's complicated. I don't want to drag you into this, okay? Not yet, anyway. I'm getting scared now. But people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Oh, so it like is nighttime. who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sherlock? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. I'll see you later. But aren't we, sleep aren't we sneaking out, though? So that's kind of a lie. Uh, so that shit affects, that shit yes, affected something. Yes, the Vortex Club does indeed suck. That shit did indeed affect something. Oh, we gotta, we gotta use the laptop in our room. Aw, Trevor is a sweetie. Good for Dana. Hey Dana, I've been thinking about you all day, and I know it's hard for you to see Kate. I was up for the roof today, sorry. Uh, glad that Mac moved up like I see where I I don't have anything deep or smart to say. I just want you to know that you're a good friend and Kate. I, a uh, good friend to Kate, and I wish she had more friends like you. You have to be so good for me when everybody else is so fucked up. You have been so good to me when everybody else has been fucked up, and I am here for you always. I missed you. I miss you, Trev. Thank you so much for thinking of me. I keep seeing Kate on that roof, and I feel like I should have done something more to help her. Max did more than anybody to save Kate, and I don't even think they're BFFs. Uh, so happy you're thinking about me. I can't wait to see you tomorrow, and you're just as good for me as you think I am for you, blah, blah, or something like that. Uh, dreaming of you tonight. Aw. If Dana talks to Juliet about this, she's going to wish she didn't. Dana, I hope you're doing okay after today. I don't want to bother you, but I'm writing an article about Kate for the paper, and I wanted to know if you could answer just a few short questions. It seems there are too few many answers. Let's talk when convenient for you, okay? Hope. I hope you're well. Hi, Julia. I know you're wanting to find out more about Kate, but I'm still a little shaken up after today. I don't think you'll get too many answers so so soon after what happened today. And maybe it'll be better to keep a low profile for a moment. Kate deserves some privacy for a change. She sure does. Hop, hop off for your fucking news article. Get the fuck out of here, bitch. You got any trophies in here, by the way? Bruh, it's right here. It's right. It's literally right here, bruh. It's literally right there. Um, I don't know. Maybe there's a type of conversation you can have to get a picture of this. But, bro, I'm not about to sit here all day just trying to get get that picture. Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time going through her shit. True. Why is everybody typing waiting for you, Kate? Like, what does that fucking mean? Y'all all fake, bro. Bruh, people only care about people once they did. Glad the media doesn't waste a second exploiting Kate. Now sure she has don't. another video of herself all over the web. And even I'm in this one. Oh, at least the news didn't mention my name. Yet. Hmm. Huh. Besides Rachel, it's been a while since anybody vanished from Arcadia Bay. 
I shouldn't sound so disappointed. And these were all the names that were on the book, on that book. But whoever this person is, they gotta be fucking old, bruh. This has been going on forever. It has to be that I fucking... I sure hope these people treat her better when she comes back to school. If she does. There's gotta be that janitor, bruh. Either that janitor or Nathan's fucking dad. Fake. Look at all this fake shit, bruh. Nobody was ever hitting her shit up. Either I delete my page or I block everybody. Nowhere to hide these days. Everybody will be talking about Kate now. Yep. Blackwell might as well shut down for the next month. They phony. They fake. That's the type of people I hate. I only care about people when they try to take their life. They don't even give a fuck, nigga. Where? What the fuck? So Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. Bet. All right, here's the squirrel. Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me get a picture of this squirrel, though. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Oh, did I scare it off? God dang it. Why can't I not take a picture? These, shit, these shits are getting harder and harder each time. Bro, y'all seen me try to get the squirrel. I don't know what happened, so fuck it. I do not care. I feel so giddy, even after Kate almost jumped. Maybe it's the leftover adrenaline. But I feel kind of invincible now. I hate that sound. Maybe Samuel should fix that lamp. Samuel doesn't do shit around here, but sweep the same area 500 times. Principal ah. Wells, oh, are you serious? I'm, I'm toast if he sees me. Nobody can expel me. Not yet, anyway. Again. Oh God. Whoa. All right, so this says she's in the main hall. Creepy at night. Don't know how much how I feel about this. Right, buddy. Oh, yeah. Fucking what the fuck? Get it? Boo yeah. Like I'm a scary punk ghost. More like a scary punk asshole. Hey Chloe, I didn't exactly have the greatest day trying to keep my friend from jumping off the roof. I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? okay? Sorry, but you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. Kate saved herself. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. Don't be so modest, Rockstar. Kate is alive because of you. You obviously said the right thing, and your badass power is gonna save us all. We just need to connect the plays. 
and find out who almost killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? Didn't you say that it was all about chaos theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Oh right, except for your ability to... Oh yeah, manipulate time and space? No biggie. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? About Kate, about Rachel. Oh. Right. For one thing, there's too much coincidence between the people around Kate and Rachel. Like Step Prick and Nathan Prescott? Um... I don't think it's just them. Not just them. Yep. I just want to beat the shit out of those particular bros. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... Alive? I have to think that, Chloe. Her spirit is so powerful here. Maybe too much power. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, Step Prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. A boss bitch. I just... Don't want you to get into any more trouble. Well, look she at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At yeah, this she... point, who gives a fuck anymore? Yeah, she doesn't even care We're anymore. We're in it to win it, Max. The lights just went off. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long it... as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. Okay, but, um, I don't know if Rachel's alive. I don't know. But I thought they were Thank talking about Kate. Thank you so much for helping me put together a portfolio. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted. As you know, it's not been a good day for Blackwell. They're gonna kiss. I know this has been an awful day, and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. I don't know what I would have done if Katie jumped. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen. What? You've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. Wow. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... Trying to be a thought. Yeah, you you cute or you bad or whatever. Are you fucking kidding me? But not everybody wants you, okay? It's about your personality, and you got a shitty one. The shittiest of them. It's so stupid. No ass. Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. You're damn right. She was dead ass about to suck some dick for a, for a fucking photo shit. Well, it has to do with school, but like, fuck that. School is never that important, bruh. Even if I was about to fail like that, the SATs, SOL, I'm not about to go to the instructor and be like, look. Chloe the Keymaster. You look, know it. Ma'am, I'll eat your ass. Just come on. Give me some points. Give me some points. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. Max, not you to mention the weed you brought into my room. 
joking. I'm serious. We're not right. kids anymore. Joking. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? They can't charge us for just entering. I'm serious. We could go to jail. True. Not if I'm related to the head of Blackwell security. Step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. But my powers didn't save Kate. Maybe I did on my own. Sure. Come on. One more door and our work here is done. Alright, fuck it. You're right, you're right, you're right. But uh, let me do some. Let me do some. Investigate and see what's at, what else is over here. I can't. I can't. It's too scary, y'all. It's too scary. It's too scary to go by myself. I need my buddy here with me. Open that shit up, girl. That's it. What the fuck? The security officer should have the key to the principal's office. He's hiding shit. Like everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door open. Believe it or not, I know a little about lockpicking. Thanks to Frank. I'm not very surprised. I might as well test out my thief skill. Go for it. We're already in this deep. Well, you could look for the key. Just in case. Why, yes, I could. By myself? Just that bullshit. Oh, okay. It's right here. Nothing here. But files? Look through them bitches. I would look through all of them files. Dead La end. Labeled K, labeled R. Boring. Boring, like, totally freaked me out. I mean, right on. Crap. Where been at there? I give up. Nothing to see here. No That's key us. for thee. We have to find another way in. Guess I didn't spend enough time with Frank, but I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. Hey, Warren, you busy? Uh-oh. Just bubble hearth, you'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. Without naming names, if somebody had access to the art and science labs and wanted to construct a device that would, say, open a locked door, would you maybe kinda know how? Huh? No, I'm just asking for fun. Thanks, science guy. Uh, no, 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 stay. We need you as backup. Just send the text instructions now. God damn it. Yes, I'm still all in to go ape with you at the drive-in. Thanks for the help. Uh, I don't know. This but sucks ass. I don't God know if we got time for that. Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell. Sorry, Max. I got nothing. What about your plan? I'm gonna go put it together. Can you stay here and not get caught? I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. See you soon. See you soon. So... Any questions? Sodium chlor... What the fuck? It's just the powder they use to create chlorine dioxide. Shit, everybody knows that. So are you really going to try this? Keyword, try. I bow to your wisdom. Here's how you do it. Uh... Step one, hold on. Now pay attention, 007. You have to find four objects, sugar, a soda can, duct tape, sodium chlorate. So sugar, two, wrap it around, put it together. You do the loop the loop and boom. Now your shoes are looking good. So I definitely know where we have Warren to go. Warren is such a classic nerd. Let's see if I can find those items. They're most likely in, what the fuck? Gross. What do I need to look in these trash cans for, though? There may be something in here. Nothing here. So glad you still have your locker, Kate. True. It's total legitness. Alright, so this is a can. Okay, I have the can. Three more Only items. Three to more go. items to go. Jinx. here or like why is it like look like something was leaking don't lock your doors huh this is like a scene in a horror film please don't say that 
Please don't say that, because all I need is for said scene to actually happen. Bruh, this reminds me of school when people... Or, oh, I think it was elementary school when people put the chairs on the fucking table. Victoria's cigarettes? <laughs> I'm sure Mr. Jefferson is impressed. Victoria smokes? Ew. Disgusting. Oh, Kate. Even when you were sad, you tried to see- Daniel's a better illustrator than photographer, said Max, the art critic. Victoria, that is pretty fucking sweet. How can I hate somebody that shoots like that? It's not even that good, bruh. If I'm being honest, bruh, it's just a picture of a man with his head. I feel gross even looking at Nathan's work, but he does have some style. And what does he take a picture of? Or, like, is this a drawing? Someone at a fucking gravesite. So what does that mean? Here's the duct tape. The tape is mine. You're halfway home, Max. Shit, Warren texted me. You still there? Did you blow up? Max. Still here, didn't blow up. Not yet. I need to concentrate now. Talk to you later. Yeah, let me focus. Let me focus. God damn. What time is it? Hold up. Bruh, it's 11. Oh, that's not right. Bruh, where's Warren's number? I got another text from that private number. Oh, it's 12 in the morning. Hey whore, feminists, feminists will be exterminated. Watch out, what? Sorry, mom, I'll call you back in a few minutes. Thank you. Thanks for letting me gush over our Blackwell hero. I miss your voice, very proud. So milk this moment. Let us know if you want us to come up for a quick getaway, okay? We'll love you. Bruh, please come up here for, for a quick getaway. I don't wanna be here anymore. This school is not worth being at. Niggas is dying every day, B. I know they know about the kidnappings. They not worried about me? Holy shit. This place is so weird. Here's the sodium chloride box. Okay. You're an artist, damn it, not a scientist. But this is so not sodium chlorate. Can she reach this? You know you're clumsy, Max. Don't waste your rewind power. Use the damn chair. Hey, I know you're clumsy, but I didn't want to be mean. I thought you can do it on your own. Only one more ingredient left. It's called being confident. Sugar. Spice. Oh, here's the sugar right here. Oh, hold on, what's this? Only a B minus? Warren has shattered my faith. Of course, I'm barely passing science. Good job, Warren, you fucking nerd. What is this diagram? Oh shit. Wish I knew what periodic means. Well, the natural, I don't know. Ooh, sugar. <laughs> sugar! Spice. Now it's time to show Chloe that Max is the bomb. I think I already said that. Come on. Come on, Max. Not with these not with these puns right now. I do not need to be hearing that. I mean, I know already not I'm not gonna get all these, so it's whatever. But uh Doesn't hurt I uh, doesn't hurt to look. Oh, fish tank. Here we go. What up? What I gotta what I what I, how how Everybody's asleep. I hate to wake them up, but I want a picture. Wake them up, baby. Good evening, fish fish. Good evening, fish fish. Flash. Thanks, fish. Nice work. Now to turn this back off, cause- Please resume your slumber. I don't wanna fuck no shit up. 
All right, my bad. I thought you could take a picture of that uh, cigarette box. That Victoria had, but nope, that wasn't the pipe. That wasn't the- Take it uh, easy on the door, Chloe. Point. Let's try this instead. Ooh, literally. Yes, time to blow shit up. Isn't that shit gonna be if loud? you light the candle. This is so cool. Can I take Get a Get ready to haul ass. Cool. Oh, we are toast. Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department. Uh, so what should we do? Bro, first, first, if anything, why wouldn't it? Oh shit. time as possible uh, is there really nothing in here I need to figure this out I remember I just need to rewind back to when the door initially opened oh what the fuck what the fuck If I can get this bastard open, she can't cheat with a rewind. Oh, this is bullshit. Fuck you, door. Welcome to my domain. You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. The company I keep. Now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers only go so far. Man, I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy Thor, crap. Even think about he must that. want everybody to know he has money, but no taste. That's crazy. How can you trust somebody who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? Picture. I'm glad I was expelled. Yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be at Blackwell. Eat me. I'm gonna pill for the papers on this ugly ass desk. I got a bad feeling about this. Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair. Chloe pay played too damn much. This is your chance to truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock. Find us some clues about Rachel, or Kate, or Nathan. Anybody. I'm on the case. You don't want at the computer. If anything, you should be finding clues. Now let me take a picture of this damn bird. You're not so tacky up close. I want the picture of the fucking bird. Now let me get the fucking picture, bitch. Give me uh, the fucking picture of a lay fucking lord. You fucking. Oh, okay, what did Warren say? Didn't need it after all, bruh. Uh, so did you. I uh, need to call you. Oh, please, I just wanted to see if you knew you explosives and to see your incredible artwork. Okay. So, Nathan Prescott's dad is a bully, too. Shocker. Principal Wells, in light of the recent outrageous uh, allegations against my son and his suspension, I feel that my large contribution to Blackwell Academy should also be suspended. Of course, this situation can be ref ret retrofied. Once Nathan is reinstated at Blackwell with a written apology. Along with that, I understand that this tragic event involving Miss Marsh gives you pause. But I would suggest that canceling Thursday party would not uh, conducive or is not conducive to the can-do spirit of Blackwell Academy. I expect you to reconsider and come to the same obvious conclusion. Thank you, Sean Prescott the dick what a bitch what a fucking pussy and you're a bitch uh, that is so cool that my signature actually counted go miss grant what let me see this dear miss grant as principal of blackwell academy it is my glad happy fortunate duty uh to inform you that your petition to block the installation installation of 
a new surveillance system has received enough signatures for the school to reject the plan. It is my policy to take sides. It is not my policy to take sides in these matters. Look at my thighs, y'all. Um, as we encourage the faculty and students and body to blah, blah, in their school. However, I did recognize the controversial nature of these cameras and shared your concern for possible invasion of privacy. Thank you. Uh, thank you for your passion and for inspiring Blackwell students to make their voices heard. I hope they feel empowered by the outcome of your petition. That's good to hear because now we don't have any videos uh, in the school, which means no one can just be watching us at their will unless somebody unless they're already installed which would be fucked up but um yeah I'm, I'm glad we signed that petition i'm i'm very i'm very glad we signed that petition. look at this pile you gonna search through the pile look at this pile you gonna search through the pile tumbleweeds bro you are a horrible investigator looks like an oil painting spill awful you're horrible you are horrible this pretty much sums up Kate. Shy and sweet. And in the wrong place. Damn. Student information sheet, Kate Beverly Marsh. GPA 3.9. Kate Marsh represents the very best of students at Blackwell Academy. Her GPA is consistently outstanding, along with her optimistic attitude and quiet work ethic. Her extra extracurricular activities with the Meals on Wheels program has acknowledged has been acknowledged on KBay 7 News and her diverse religious studies group uh, has been a welcome addition to the wide range of student-led sp uh, spiritual programs at Blackwell. She also has one of the best attendance records in the school's history, Principal Wells. As, as the school nurse, I should inform you that Kate Marsh appears to have experienced some recent emotional, emotional and physical trauma. I spoke to her briefly and she said she was upset but vague and refused to talk with me further. I think it's important that we keep our eyes on her and make sure she's not under duress from other classmates as is my suspicion. But what did he do? Ignore this shit. Update. Uh, at present time there is a security investigation into the controversial video. Controversial video alleged allegedly featuring Kate Marsh at a Vortex Club party that has been uploaded on the internet without her knowledge or alleged consent along with her claim of being taken to the hospital to the party after the party she attached files for complete details only two more files to go oh so what okay so I guess I'm just searching wowzer this will so not come in handy what is that? I'd drink too if I was the principal of Blackwell. Yeah, good hiding spot. And nothing here. Bruh. Bruh, it's behind the paintings. They should be hanging in a thrift store. It's behind the paintings. There we go. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this. But there's not much here about the police investigation. Oh, this is about Rachel, okay. Uh, for Rachel Dawn Amber. Unfortunately, Rachel Amber Amber has stopped attending class for the past months, or past month, and left no contact with students and the faculty for the past month. Her parents are at the present unaware of her whereabouts, and Blackwell hopes for her quick return and continue to academy academic excellence. A brief summary: uh, Rachel Amber is the quintessential. Quentin said, y'all know what that word is, god damn it. Student representation of Blackwell Academy, she excels in all of her studies and extracurricular activities, which are numerous. Popular with both students and faculty, she has the of scholarships and leadership that is a hallmark of Blackwell's legacy. Her, device, her diverse goals include a career in international law and fashion modeling. There is no doubt that Rachel will achieve all of her dreams with Blackwell as the f what are these fucking words uh principal wells this is lieutenant chris rossi we want to let you know that rachel amber's investigation has officially been closed on our end we always hope for that one magic clue but once again arcadia bay covers up another secret we always keep our eyes and ears open but that's all we can do from now thank you for your help arcadia bay covers up another secret Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. 
bad, Chloe. Bruh, her GPA is 1.7. My god. Um, GPA 1.7. Uh, let's see. Brief summary. Chloe Price is a problematic student at Blackwell. Despite the best efforts of the facility and administration to guide her academically, Chloe does little homework and is often well and full belligerent to her teacher. She has caused numerous class disruptions and with inappropriate comments and rude gestures to fellow students. Uh, she was recently suspended for spray painting graffiti in the parking lot. Even though Chloe is an intelligent student with potential, she chooses to squander it on empty rebellion against a non-mandatory institution. Update, Chloe Price is no longer a student at Blackwell. See attached police records. <laughs> Goddamn. Let's nab this last file, Sherlock. Weird. This asshole has like I'm not gonna Whoa. read my own personal file. Hold up. Where this asshole I didn't see what they said. I accidentally hit the other one. Okay, student information sheet. Nathan Joshua Prescott, GPA 3.7. Brief summary. Nathan Prescott continues his family's historical legacy at Blackwell Academy with a stellar academic record and a variety of extracurricular activities, including work with Arcadia Bay Homeless Fund. Nathan is also popular with students and faculty. Okay. He stands as a proud representation of Blackwell. Yeah, get his dick out your mouth, please. Um... Let's see, 2.8, Maxine. Uh, Max, as she's preferred to be called, is a considerable, is considered a quiet, attentive, I thought that said attractive, I was about to say, what? Is a quiet, attentive student with much potential for her photography. Her GPA fluctu fluctuates as, and she has acknowledged she should be doing better. Her teachers back her up, back up her quiet intelligence, though some complaints find her too nervous and nosy <laughs> some faculty members would like max to speak up more in class and be more assertive others would like her to be less so but this is a common student suggestion rather than a specific recommendation update despite some recent confrontations with blackwell security max showed herself to represent very the very best of Blackwell Academy by stopping a fellow student, Kate Marsh, from jumping off the dormitory roof today. At this time, there's no ongoing police slash faculty investigation, but Max heroism is undisputed. You damn right, bitch. This file is going to be so spotless, I'll projectile vomit. Victoria. 3.9. Victoria Chase is the gold standard for. Oh my gosh. Blackwell Academy, a student with a cons consistently high GPA and extracurricular activity that reflects her career goals and photography. Victoria also receives high marks from the faculty for her devo devotion to the Vortex Club, among other organizations devoted to Blackwell spirits and history. Or whatever. I have to make sure Warren doesn't have a criminal background. True. 4.0. What a fucking nerd. <laughs> Let me stop. Get, get them GPAs up. Uh, <clears throat> Warren is considered an exemplary student and represents a long tradition of excellence in science at, at Blackwell. He has a gift of court of court. Oh, he has he has the gift or curse of gab, depending on the faculty. Uh, some have accused him of playing science pranks, but this is not confirmed by his teacher, Miss Grant. We hope Warren focuses his academic visions and continues towards his bright future. The fuckery. I think we found everything in here. I should go join Chloe now. The fuckery is so real. Still can't take a picture of this bird. Have to talk to him. There's got to Max. You better come check out these files. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus, and my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. I Nathan called it. Prescott the third. Ooh, he's so money. And you know the Prescott's dropped Major Bank to bury Nathan's real file. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? At least Nathan was finally suspended. Check out that note. Open it. It's just some crazy drawing. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. 
That's it. That's fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Whoa, listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. <sighs> it's pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we know he was all over Rachel, too. Huh. We are so going into his garage <clears throat> files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know how you roll. We should definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Holy shit! Jackpot! Cha-ching! Wow, sir. That's a lot for the handicapped fund. Dude, there's $5,000 here. I could pay Frank back tonight. This'll chill him out after our knife showdown yesterday. Are you uh gonna make a big issue out of this? Or just rewind and take the greenbacks for yourself? I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. Fuck. Fuck. Bro. I feel like this principal is in it. I feel like the principal is in it for some reason, but Chloe, you can't you can't take that money. You take the money. But then again, five thousand dollars for handicap? Is it really for the handicap? Is it really for the handicap? Can I really trust this dude? Leave leave the money. Leave the money. You really want to take money from the handicapped fund? I know you need to pay Frank back, but I've got my power to protect you, right? There's a lot of power in that horse-choking wad of cash. But yes, Moral Max is right again. I guess. Let's get the hell out of this office, Morg. Yeah, we're not stealing that money. There's like, that was, that would be dumb. I know that money would have helped Chloe and me. Yeah, but like, come on now, that would be so stupid to do. Should we rewind and see what happens if you take it? No, 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 fuck it, fuck it. Just, just... Cause like, that, that, that would just be so dumb. Can I take a picture of this shit now? Nope, still no, still no picture. Y'all can read that if y'all want to. That is weird. What a weirdo. What a fecking weirdo. That impish look scares me. Care for a midnight swim? The Blackwell pool is ours. Swimming? Bruh, I knew she you was- You wanna take that risk now? Can we just leave? It's been a cray week. You didn't let me take that money to pay off Frank, so if he pops a cap in my skull, at least allow me to have a little carefree fun for a few minutes. Splish splash? You're right. We hella deserve it. A splish splash, splish splash. when I'm taking a bath. Did you actually just say hella? I think I'm a good bad influence on you. Bro, this is a horrible- What the fuck do we have to go for a swim for, bruh? I don't know. I don't know. But if you guys enjoyed this episode, go ahead and hit that thumbs up. Um, part two of episode three coming up tomorrow. What the fuck is going on, bro? What is going on?